back with another video and in today's video i will be showing you the most op combo ever in black ops 4 zombies so if you guys do enjoy the video make sure you do smash that like button let's see if we can reach 10 likes on this video i know you guys can do it and we are only three subscribers away from 120 subscribers so if you guys could please subscribe and share this video with your friends so they can also subscribe to the channel and yeah let's get right into this video so as you can tell by the perks i have some really weird looking perks right now and you're probably wondering why do you have phd slider and why do you have deadshot daiquiri in your tonic slot i will be basically you know going over why i have those perks there in just a second so basically why i have these perks it basically involves the trench gun it's not the normal trench gun that is the reason why we need these perks. It is the upgraded version. And if you don't know what the upgraded version actually does, basically when you upgrade the trench gun, it turns into like a grenade launcher sort of thing, but it's still a pump action shotgun. I don't know really how to describe it. I guess it's a pump action explosive weapon. I guess that's how you describe it, like the China Lake in Black Ops 1. But yeah, basically when I get a uh, PhD slider and all of my other perks, I will show you why we actually need those perks. Okay, so I actually haven't done this before, but I have seen uh, a video on this before. His The YouTube channel name uh, of the person that I got it from is 2 pro for you adam um, He's a really great YouTuber. Uh, I'll leave a link down in the description to his youtube channel i actually really enjoy his content um so yeah y'all should go subscribe to him if you want to see more black ops 4 gameplay on and whatnot he's really popular and stuff like that but yeah i wonder if they've actually patched this because if they have then uh the video's ruined so i've actually never used phd slider before and when the game first came out i know that it only took away you know a little bit of explosive damage but in the recent patch uh it negates all explosive damage so you know i'm assuming that it'll be pretty good and now that it negates all explosive damage i feel like it's going to be a lot better than phd uh flopper in my opinion i don't know some people might disagree because of the sliding and whatnot but i don't know that's just my opinion and speaking about opinions you know What's your opinion on Black Ops 4? Should I do more gameplay on it? You know, what do you want to see from me? So, le look up in the right-hand corner, right? You see that little icon? Yeah. Go up there, click on that, and uh, tell me what you think about Black Ops 4. Do you think it's a good game? Should I do more gameplay on it and whatnot? So, yeah, just look up in that right-hand corner, and yeah. 4,000 for PhD Slider? Oh, my God. That's a ripoff. That's like a major turnoff for this perk. It's 4,000? Really? I don't know. I mean, I guess if you bought it in, like, the later rounds when you've got a bunch of points, you know, then I guess that wouldn't matter, but I don't know. You guys want to hear a very unpopular opinion? My favorite map in Black Ops 4 is uh, Blood of the Dead. If you couldn't tell, I mean, I've only done, like, three videos on Black Ops 4, uh, and two out of the three were on Blood of the Dead, and the other one was on uh, the Gauntlet mode on IX. And I don't understand why everyone hates this map. It's actually a really good map. And I'm going to be completely honest. I absolutely hate the Chaos storyline. The characters are bad. The maps... I know this is going to be an unpopular opinion, but the maps are bad. I I don't know. I've been playing Zombies for 10 years now, and I'm just so used to the Ether storyline and the characters, you know? I, I don't know. But at the end of the day, it's just my opinion. Okay, so back to the whole topic of this whole entire video. Um, basically, why I have these perks is because the upgraded trench gun. And if you don't know what Deadshot does uh, in the Operator mod, basically, if you get five headshots, like a five headshot streak, then you have an extra damage boost. If you miss one of those headshots, the, um, the streak goes away, obviously. Since the trench gun, when you upgrade it, is actually an explosive weapon, you keep that multiplier even if you don't aim for the head. So that's also why I have PhD slider. Wait, where did he come from? Okay, so now our dead shot daiquiri is now lighting up because we got five headshots in a row. So basically, I can't miss my shots now. Oh, well, there it goes. Okay, there we go. We got 5,000 points now. Now I want to upgrade my trench gun. Upgrade that bad boy. Oh, 
Okay, so we have our trench gun fully upgraded now. So I can't imagine how much damage this thing, like, actually does, you know? Because if we get a 5 sh headshot multiplier on a normal weapon, like, let's say, the KN-57, that it can nearly one-shot a zombie with, like, one bullet. How the heck did I just die? Excuse me, game? Oh my god. I don't want to get any more gameplay for this. I'm sorry, everyone. I just can't get any more gameplay. I've tried this so many times before. Oh my god. Alright, this is going to be the end of the video. So if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you do smash that like button. Let's see if we can reach 10 likes on this video. I know we can do it. And we are only 3 subscribers away from being at 120 subscribers so if you guys could please share this video with your friends so they can also subscribe to the channel and yeah make sure you check out the last live stream that i did on Star one from one that was extremely fun going back and playing that game and if you guys want me to play any more of black ops 4 or you know Star one from one make sure you look up in that right hand corner and tell me which game you want me to play more and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one peace out my dudes